Hiya fam, welcome back. Hope you guys are having a great day. I'm Joe. I'm Dan. It's movie time once again. What's playing, Dan? We're watching the Mel Brooks classic, Blazing Saddles. I've been looking forward to this for one for a while. It's a great one. We don't get a whole lot of westerns on this channel anyway, and we kind of needed one. Yeah. Cheers to you fam, enjoy. He rode a blazing saddle. He... Well, it feels like a western already, doesn't it? Yeah. That was actually kind of a nice song. Yes, it was. An Oscar nominated song. Really? Yeah. Wow. Good on them. I don't hear no singing. Come on, how about a good old work song? <laughs> what in the actual I hate this guy already. <laughs> how about the Camp Town Lady? The Camp Town Ladies. The Camp Town Racetrack five miles long. All the dude all day. Shouldn't we be working right now? <laughs> Apparently not. Okay. It's turned into a sing-off. I'd say the Cowboys lost this one, man. <laughs> <laughs> In the wide, wide world of sports, is it? <laughs> <laughs> I had you people try to get a little track lead, not to jump around like a bunch of Kansas City. F Damn! Oh, <laughs> Surveyors say they may run into some quicksand up ahead. Send over a couple of minutes. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's terrible. For the camp town ladies. <laughs> oh, they didn't know it. They know it really well. Am I wrong, or is the world rising? Rising. <laughs> Whatever it is. I hate it. <laughs> it don't look good. Quicksand! Damn, what happened to the tracks? <laughs> Apparently it sank. <laughs> wow, hit your rope there. Oh, you oh, sons of bitches. <laughs> I'd be so offended right now. You should be. Oh, they're safe. <laughs> I feared the worst there for a second. Uh-uh, baby. Oh, don't do that. I have to. Oh, see, is he gonna kill his ass? Kill him and I said, ow! <laughs> <laughs> tell him I said, Ow. <laughs> Good attention to detail it. <laughs> yes. And right here, Mr. Lamar, is where we run into the quicksand. Though the railroad has got to go through Rock Ridge. Rock Ridge, Rock Ridge, splendid. Why is that splendid? I know. Need a plan. What in the hell was that? Boris, what? we can't hear ourselves think. Oh. I think you're in the wrong movie, pal. <laughs> I was going to say, what's the video of armor? I know how we can run everybody out of Rock Ridge. How? We'll kill the firstborn male child in every household. Jesus Good Lord. Too Jewish. <laughs> Too Jewish. Wow. <laughs> so he's not opposed to the idea, just... My Taggart, you've been hurt. Oh, that uppity <laughs> went and hit me on the head with a shovel. Got him locked up downstairs. You mean you actually captured him? I mean, he didn't run. Boris! Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Gonna hang the guy and his horse. <laughs> We'll make Rock Ridge think it's a chicken that got caught in a tractor's nuts. <laughs> oh, I don't know how to picture that. I don't either. Well, it's a nice little western town. Mm -hmm. You got everything. Good. Howard Gen Johnson's. You got a Hojo's. You got a general <laughs> store. All that. <laughs> oh, Cal's in the bar. Look, Cal's got a drink too. Oh, oh Jesus. I am not drinking out of that glass. <laughs> Give me the bottle. I mean, he's a dirty dude anyway. Oh my god. <laughs> they're actually gonna do this? <laughs> yep. Or they're gonna attempt? <laughs> they're already inside? I'll be damned. <laughs> oh, you idiot. Well, How did... this suit. <laughs> yeah. How did it get so muddy out here? Oh. <laughs> this guy's taking a shower? Yes. Oh, ow. Have you ever seen such cruelty? <laughs> <laughs> Nope, you're the first. <laughs> Sheriff murdered, crops burned, people stampeded, and cattle raped. Uh -oh. What? What? Uh -oh. Who did that? <laughs> now the time has come to act fast. I'm leaving. <laughs> <laughs> Our fathers came across the prairie, fought Indian, fought drought, fought locusts, fought dicks. What? <laughs> <laughs> Olson Johnson is right. I say we stay and... Fight it up! Dr. Oh, Samuel Jesus. Johnson's right. Everybody's named Johnson. <laughs> Why don't we wire the governor to send us a share? Our Johnson is right. <laughs> we'll wire the governor. Right. Right. <laughs> the governor, may I disturb you for a moment, sir? Ah, uh, <laughs> good to see is. you, Mr. Brooks. Work, 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 work. Hello, boys. Have a good night's rest. I missed you. He's a typical politician. Mm-hmm. The bill 
Buffalo will convert the State Hospital for the Insane into the William J. Lepetamine Memorial Gambling Casino for the Insane. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> More or less, yes. Yeah. You're kind of lawyer. <laughs> Reign of Terror must see. Send your sheriff immediately. Holy underwear! We've got to protect our phony baloney job, gentlemen. We must do something about this immediately. Prosecutor didn't see that one coming. <laughs> Why don't you give these out to some of the boys in lieu of pay? Here you go. In lieu of pay? Hey, hey, uh, no. <laughs> I need my money. Law and order is the last thing I want. Says the lawyer. <laughs> if I could find a sheriff who so offends the citizens of Rock Ridge that his very appearance would drive them out of town, where would I find such a man? Why am I asking you? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe we have better ideas than you do. Maybe. Governor, as per your instructions, I'd like you to meet the new sheriff. I'd be delighted. Wow! <laughs> you gone berserk. Can't you see that that man is a nip? <laughs> <laughs> well, that didn't work out. Have you gone berserk? Can't you see that that man is a nip? Don't worry, sir. Unbelievable. <laughs> It'll never work. They'll kill him dead one day. One day is all we'll need to secure your name in the annals of Western history. It's still historical, yeah. I suppose so, yeah. <laughs> well, they didn't last long. <laughs> it is my privilege to extend a laurel and hearty handshake to our new. Oh, God. <laughs> Chill out, folks. <laughs> For God's sake. There. Let me help you with that. <laughs> Look at him already cleaning up his town. <laughs> Excuse me while I whip this out. <laughs> <laughs> well, that got dark real fast. It got very unlawful. I implore you to pay heed to this good book and what it has to say. <laughs> Somebody said no. You're on your own. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> Not even God can help you now. Hold it. The next man makes a move, the next Gets it. <laughs> Don't tell me that was gonna work. Oh, Lordy Lord, he's desperate. Do what he said. <laughs> Isn't anybody gonna help that poor man? <laughs> yeah, we're about to shoot him. Help me. Somebody help me. Help me. Help me. Help me. Shut up. <laughs> She's she kidnapped himself. Oh, baby. <laughs> you are so talented. They are so dumb. <laughs> Yes, they are. Yes, they are. I got no response, man. They all are Johnsons. Look, look. <laughs> look at all that. <laughs> Bunch of inbred swine. <laughs> Nietzsche says, out of chaos comes order. Blowing out your ass, Howard. <laughs> You're too dumb to know about <laughs> Nietzsche. <Yeah. laughs> to express our extreme displeasure with your choice of sheriff, you are the leading asshole in the state. <laughs> mm. Well spoken. Are we awake? Is that Gene Wilder? Yes. Nice. Good to see you, sir. Always a pleasure. What's your name? My name is Jim. Most people call me Jim. Mm. Oh, so your name is Jim. Okay. What are your pleasures? What do you like to do? Well, play chess. <laughs> Screw. <laughs> well, let's play chess. <laughs> <laughs> I used to be called... The Waco Kid. He had the fastest hands in the West. In the world. Quite a boast. Mm -hmm. When you hear the word go, you just try to grab it. Whatever. <laughs> go. Well, apparently not. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. And there I was, face to face with a six-year-old kid. What? Mm. Damn. Threw my guns down and walked away. At least you didn't shoot the kid. Little bastard shot me in the ass. <laughs> <laughs> Crawl inside a whiskey bottle. I've been there ever since. Over getting shot in the ass by a six-year-old? Or the fact that a six-year-old was challenging him in the first place? My folks and I were part of this long wagon train. The white right, my people didn't let us travel in their circle, so we made our own. <laughs> made one. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't care about you. Mel Brooks again. Oh my god, I didn't even thank you. I didn't notice. Got the walk. It's all right. Thank you. You're speaking Yiddish. <laughs> I know. <laughs> oh god. Oh, oh, it's getting dangerous over there. 
<laughs> God's sake. <laughs> They're all shitting in their drawers. <laughs> Sounds like it. Some of those sound kind of moist. <laughs> Somebody had to shaft themselves. Yeah. How about some more beans, Mr. Taggart? I'd say you've had enough. Yeah. <laughs> How'd you like to mutilate that new sheriff? <laughs> what the hell is he supposed to be? Their dog? I don't know. They act like one. Their master blaster? Oh, by the way, I got a note this morning. It was addressed to the deputy spade. <laughs> really? <laughs> Deputy Spade might turn out to be a groovy position. You can't win these people over no matter what you do. They're just not going to accept you. Catch you later. Good luck. <laughs> Sound like Mickey Mouse. It makes no sense. You've been living inside a whiskey bottle all this time, but you can't handle a joint? <laughs> Apparently not. Good morning, ma'am. And isn't it a lovely morning? Up yours. Damn. Jeez. Wow. <laughs> to his face. <laughs> What did you expect? These are people of the land, the common clay of the New West. Morons. <laughs> <laughs> exactly right. Oh, is that what it sounds like when he comes into town? Apparently so. Oh, he's riding a damn... <laughs> An ox. A bull. Jeesh. Hey, you can't park that animal over there. It's illegal. Oh! oh. Guy pulled a Conan. That horse looked like it actually got hit. <laughs> it did, too. Here comes Mungo! <laughs> Sheriff, Mungo's back. He's... Uh, who is this Mongo anyway? Well, Mongo ain't exactly a who. He's more of a what. Mm, that's fair. No, no, don't do that. Don't do that. If you shoot him, you'll just make him mad. Oh, no. He's, it's like that. Okay. <laughs> How did you manage that? Candy gram for Mongo. You came in as a Western Union employee, <laughs> all right. The hell? He just tore that up. Oh, for God's <laughs> sake. Mungo like candy. That's all, folks. Yep. <laughs> Flooded with rivulets of thought, cascading into a waterfall of creative alternatives. Something really weird about this, <laughs> you think? Oh, darn it, Mr. Lamar. You use your tongue prettier than a $20 whore. Oh, God. <laughs> Not while you're bathing me, dude. <laughs> Where's my froggy? Oh, well, look, damn your eyes. Look for it. Oh. <laughs> you are very uh, questionable as a cowboy ghost. <laughs> An 1800s cowboy, anyway. He's just not very smart. Good evening, Cheryl. Sorry about the up yours. <laughs> Water under the bridge. <laughs> Much obliged. Good night. Old damn pie. Hey, shit, I'll finish that all tonight. Heck yeah. Lily uh, 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 <laughs> Lily. Headley. It's Headley. Uh, nobody knows your name. Apparently not. How ordinary. <laughs> it's probably true for her. I cannot find the words to truly express my joy at the bullshit. <laughs> What's the job? <laughs> I have this power. Morning, noon, and night, it's drink and dancing. Some quick romancing, and then a shower. They really wrote some good entertainment in the middle of this movie, didn't they? Yeah, they did. Good music, good rhymes, all that. Music's pretty good for this movie. Yeah. Is she the one that won the Oscar here? She was nominated. Oh, wow. Okay, yeah. Yeah. I hope these guys enjoyed the show. <laughs> What's it say? Must see you alone in my dressing room. <laughs> really? For you. A wet rose. How romantic. <laughs> you can tell she's faking it now. Yeah. Why don't you uh, loosen your bullets? Ah. Damn. I feel refreshed. That's fast. That's comfortable. How's it going? It's like wet sauerkraut in my hand. Gross. <laughs> <laughs> Just like to have a little feel. Yeah. God's sake. Get out of here, you loser. Is it uh, true what they say about the way you people are oh. gifted? Mm. Oh, it's true. <laughs> it's true. It's true. Well, she ain't gonna hurt nobody. <laughs> another schnitzengruben? Jesus no, Christ. Thank you. Fifteen is my limit on schnitzen. Fifteen? <laughs> No, no, you mustn't go. I, I need you. Well, now she's a snit, uh, simp in here. Yeah. She 
You're making a German spectacle of yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I got a writ here for Mongo's release, signed by Hitley Lamar himself. Why would he be ordering that, man? That's a little shady looking. Just a little bit. <laughs> oh! You could get out any time. You're free to go. Mongo, no go. Sheriff first man ever whip Mongo. He didn't want to leave. <laughs> <laughs> Why is Hedley Lamar interested in Rock Ridge? Got to do with where Choo Choo go. <laughs> yeah, good catch. Yeah, yeah, what's going on, Big Bruce? They said you was hung. And they were right. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> what the hell, man? Why do they always got to roll in like they're going to kill everybody? <laughs> Looks like it, too, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. What if me and the boys was to shoot that dead? I wouldn't do that if I were you. <laughs> you don't know who you're messing with. <laughs> it's not gonna look like he did anything. Nope. Two, three. <laughs> <laughs> <Didn't> even... <laughs> How about a little applause for the Waco kid? <laughs> yes, very good. I'm through being Mr. Goodbar. The time has come to act and act. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> so much irony in that. <laughs> I blunged. <laughs> That's horrible, but I don't say I blame you. <laughs> I'm tired of it, too. <laughs> Where's everybody going? Read this. $100 a day, damn. That's good money back then. Yeah. Equal opportunity employer. <laughs> Just give me 24 hours to come up with a brilliant idea to save our town. No! <laughs> Do it for Randolph Scott. Randolph Scott. Chair. What was that? <laughs> well, Randolph Scott is a famous Western actor. <laughs> oh my God! And I want every future bad person more Where did the Nazis come from? And Who the greasers? I don't know. <laughs> Mel Brooks is one of them, I think. <laughs> he is. He's got a Mexican bike game. Yeah. Hundred bucks a day is a hundred bucks a day, man. That's right. No matter what part of the world it's. A... Oh my God! Well, they fit in. I yeah, mean... they do. What have you got in your mouth? Chewing gum online, eh? I hope you brought enough for everybody. Is that what it's all about? <laughs> oh. There's our ticket. Have a nice day. day. <laughs> oh, it shames me I haven't hey, seen boys, this before. <laughs> look what I got here. <laughs> hey, where are the white women at? <laughs> <laughs> That'll frenzy them up, you think? <laughs> Jeez, that worked like a charm. <clears throat> Wait a minute, they're not gonna... Oh my God. <laughs> yeah, they are. <laughs> Why, rat? How many times have I told you to wash up after weekly cross burning? <laughs> and now, for my next impression, Jesse Owens. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> We're going to build on this site an exact replica of the town of Rock Ridge. Jesus, that's going to take forever. <laughs> mm -hmm. They'll actually be destroying the fake Rock Ridge. But they'll think that it's the real Rock Ridge, but we'll know that it's the fake Rock No fooling you, yes. Mr. Johnson. <laughs> They've agreed to help yeah, us make they know how to do work. Mm -hmm. And all they ask in return is a little plot of land they can call their own the homestead. Now, what do you say? Um, oh, come on, God, guys. come on, guys. They're not asking much. Your lives are on the line. But we don't want the Irish. <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh, prairie shit. Everybody. Oh. <laughs> prairie shit. <laughs> do we have the strength, or are we just jerking off? <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, hell, they ain't gonna fool nobody. Well, if you look at it from the front, it will. Oh, wait, and they're all a bunch of damn morons. All right. I'm gonna say. That looks pretty good to me. Yeah. You gotta do something about the road, though. <laughs> yeah. And hey, nobody will notice. Um, no, nah, they probably actually won't. I'm about to embark on a great crusade. <laughs> so, <it's> the bikers <laughs> <laughs> on their horse. <laughs> it's so stupid. <laughs> Whilst I will be risking an almost certain Academy Award nomination for Best Supporting Actor. No, you won't. That's a hell of a that's a hell of a boast. Now raise your right hand for the pledge. Right. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> now go to that voodoo that you do. Oh. <laughs> All right, good luck. Don't use all your animation before you get there. I got an idea that'll slow him down to a crawl. All right, let's go. Right. Come on, you guys go over there. Come on, let's go. Come on, let's go. Oh, God, he liked that one. <laughs> yeah, he loved it. <laughs> what is this, the toll road? 
<laughs> Somebody actually gonna come up to it. <laughs> Stopped him in their tracks. <laughs> it's amazing. Somebody's got to go back and get a shitload of dirt. <laughs> well, I guess it worked. Yeah, I gave them all the time they needed. Yeah, One at a time. Come on, move him, move him through. God. <laughs> they can sit there and just watch you. Well, they're through the toll booth. They're buying it. <laughs> <laughs> they got their heads bobbling, yeah. too? I think you could squeeze off a little shot from here and set off the dynamite down there. I'll give it a try. I bet he can. Nothing he can't do. You do it better when he's been drinking. Lord, keep this man's <laughs> eye keen and make us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, shut up right now. They're still buying it. <laughs> now they're not. We've been suckered in. Damn. Cowboys flying. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, horses be... too. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. That was a hell of a plan. <laughs> Thank God they're all idiots. <laughs> I love it. What the hell? <laughs> Good enough. <laughs> It's working out much better than I thought it was. Jesus, Mongo. <laughs> Jesus, set Mongo out. <laughs> oh, come on, man. Not the sheriff. Yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. She found her people. Holy shit. What the hell's going on here? That not make any sense. I thought they were fake buildings. What is this? You're showing all of Hollywood? <laughs> oh, shut up. <laughs> we're going meta. So be it. We've broken the fourth wall. <laughs> What the shit is this now? Are we still watching the same movie? Yes, we are. Okay. Oh, thank God for that. The fight's broken into here now. <laughs> they got way off course. Come on, girls! <laughs> Come on, girls! You <laughs> shit! Why are you miserable? Jesus, man. I'm parked over by the commissary. Oh! Oh! God. oh. <laughs> it didn't take long. What has happened here? I don't know. The yes, you do. You know, so look at Mongo. The movie's gone off the rails, okay? This has gone way different than I thought. What the hell is that? What the hell? It's broken into here, too? Into the commissary? Yep. Get your pies for the great pie fight. Oops. <laughs> Not the ape. <laughs> Some Hollywood stars come to eat. Keep in line. And this is what it looks like on a daily basis. Yes, probably. <laughs> I feel sorry for the janitors. Now we'll go to the <laughs> You're not going to be right back in here. You're not going to be able to avoid it forever. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> They've broken out of the studio. Well, where the hell are they going? <laughs> Wait a minute. You are way out of character here. Just a little bit. And you've shown up to your own show at screenings? Yes. Going to your own premiere while it's still going. <laughs> this cow's in the theater. Raisinets? He got some raisinets. <laughs> Why not? Hey, what the... Hey, oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for God's sake. Shit. <laughs> we'll settle it like men. With our fists. Sorry, I just remembered. I am our... Mm. Oh, no. <laughs> a bad shot. Oh. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> What is that? Douglas Fairbanks? Sheriff, you can't go now. We need you. Work here is done. Needed elsewhere now. What? What kind of lawman leaves? <laughs> you just do that? You were appointed here, weren't yeah. you? Yeah. Keep the faith, brothers! <laughs> <laughs> now look, you can't just leave them without a law and order presence here. Well, the governor's there. You can appoint somebody else. Where are you, you headed, just... <laughs> Nowhere special. I always wanted to go there. <laughs> Damn. Well, good. I'm glad he found some happiness in his life again. Yeah. And off they walk into the sunset. Right into the sunset, I should say. Or to their limo. Oh, they... <laughs> oh my god. What? Watch as they get chauffeured into the sunset. <laughs> <laughs> Waiting for the question mark here. No? All right. No, no question mark. I'll take it. Ugh. I'll take it. That's pretty good. Oh, man. 
That's pretty good. You know why it's so popular now? Yeah, I know I do. I can't believe how many damn, would you say three Academy Award nominations? It actually had three nominations for editing, for Madeline Kahn, for Best Supporting Actress, and for that opening song, Blazing Saddles. That's incredible. Yeah. Did they win any of them? I don't think they did, but they were very well done. I can see why they got nominations. Yeah, good for them. Yeah. That's great. I really love the way this was written too. Mm -hmm. Like this had beautiful writing to it. Like especially because, I mean, number one, it was funny as hell. Yeah. But it all, it was zany properly for the movie. Like that's the, for a movie like this, I wouldn't expect him for how perfect everything was for it. I say Mel Brooks is really good at doing thematic comedy, I guess would be the way to put yes. it. Yes. And he really he really covered a lot of those Western themes, you know, talking about Randolph Scott. The the mood the music sounds just like something out of a Western. Yeah. The the set design is something right straight out of a Western. Like it feels like a Western, but you know it's not. I don't know how many characters did he play? He was yeah. in there like I saw at least four three. Five. Yeah. When I was the governor, he was the one Indian. Uh huh. He, he was a townsperson there. He was also a guy standing in line. To, yeah, yeah, yeah. He was like four, at least four there. So yeah, which is what he normally does in these movies too. He usually plays more than one role. But yeah, like in Spaceballs, I remember he had a very similar role in this one. Mm -hmm. Like, cause cause he was not only a governor in this one, but he's also like a president. Right. In Spaceball, so okay, he's been the so he's been like the leader in two different types of movies there. Yeah. That's funny. I love it. I really love Gene Wilder's character. There was something about just the, just his look that, that just made me want to laugh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because like, he pulled that off beautifully. So. He did. He's, he's not the kind of person you would expect to be like a, a drunk cowboy, but he pulls it off really well. Yeah. Let's be sure that we address uh, all that ridiculous bigotry. <laughs> I, I think Mel Brooks himself said that if he tried to make that movie today, there's no way it would have flown because it's so not PC. There's no way. There's no way. They would have probably been canceled before they ever got it to theaters. Right. Which is kind of sad, to be honest with you, because, you know, not that I'm supporting bigotry or anything, but, you know, sometimes stereotypes for joke purposes can be funny. For the joke purposes, absolutely. Yeah. I mean, nobody here gave two shits. Yeah. They went along with it because they were probably loving it, too. Yeah. I, I'm sure everybody on that set thought it was hilarious. Yeah. But I mean, that just that's just goes to show the different times that we're in. Yeah. For that matter, every time I, whenever I look and see what movies are coming out, I don't see a whole lot of comedies coming out these days. Not as much as you used to, and if they are, they're they're very safe in the way they handle things. I think. Yeah, incredibly safe. Like they work really hard not to offend people. Right. And I'm like, well, that's kind of the point of comedy, <laughs> is to be offensive. <laughs> yeah, and I think a lot of you no know, comedians would say, you know, it's it's impossible to be a comedian these days because there's a, a hard line that you seem that you can't cross, which is kind of unfortunate because you know we think of America, you know, this is the land of the free. You should be able sure. to stay and do what you want up to a certain point. You know, making jokes shouldn't be something that I feel is something that I feel should not be you know limited in that sense. I feel like it's coming back around slowly, mm -hmm. a little bit because I think. I think uh, regular people have kind of had enough of it, where it's like they're tired. They're tired of having to be apologetic for everything. Yeah, and it's like, man, just let folks live their lives. All right. Mm -hmm. I don't know what where where you've gotten to that we have to be this way. Mm -hmm. But I'm glad movies like this still exist and we can all enjoy it. I say this is a comedy classic. A lot of people who grew up in the '70s, you know, saw this movie. And they love this movie. Sure. So I, I don't see why you would think that this is a bad precedent for how to do a comedy. Is that what they were saying? You think they were... You, you think... I don't... Well, I don't know if anybody's actually said that about the movie, but like I said, Mel Brooks thinks it couldn't get done. I, I kind of have to agree with him. Mm -hmm. No, he's right. Yeah. He's right. It would have been impossible. You know what? It did get done. Yeah. So there, we'll take... We'll take it. We'll take that as a win. Who is the guy... What's his name? Played the sheriff. Clevon Little. That guy did brilliant work. He did. He was hilarious. Fit that role perfectly. He had charisma on kind screen. Kind of I don't see him in more stuff. Like, he was in that one vampire movie with Jim Carrey. Once Bit? Yeah. He was in that? Yeah, because he was... Oh, was he, he the, uh, like, he, the assistant to yeah. the lady? Okay. But other than that, I can't think of any, like, big roles that he's had in the movie. That's too bad. This one? Yeah. At least he's got, like, an Academy Award-nominated movie on his resume, so... Yeah, very true. He's part of that. That's good. And, of course, Slim Pickens, you know, good character actor. He's actually been in some westerns, I think. Yeah, he was the, uh... He was, like, the leader of that, that outlaw gang there. Yeah. yeah. Okay, I reckon that's it. Didn't he also, like, in some old World War movie, like, ride a nuke into... Dr. Like Strangelove, a, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Something like that, yeah. He rode a nuke <laughs> out of the, uh, Bombay doors. Yeah, that <laughs> like, was him. Like a bull rider there. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I thought that was one of those things he was, like, popular for doing. Yeah, that's a well-known scene, so yeah. 
Nice. So in the scene there where they're all sitting around eating beans and farting, you think that's what cowboys actually did? They were just constantly stinking it up out there on the frontier? <laughs> like that? Yeah. <laughs> I can't see that the way they did that being the case. Uh, I mean, that went beyond stinking it up there. That was fouling the place to high heaven. I mean, uh, no, it's like every bite you're taking is making you shit your pants. No, yeah. I don't think so. But then again, I can't put it past them. <laughs> Because I don't know how you're keeping anything refrigerated. You're not keeping anything refrigerated no. out there. Whatever you cook is going to go right from one end to the other. Mm -hmm. Because you're like exposed to the heat and the elements out there. So mm -hmm. yeah, that's going to bubble your guts up pretty good. If you're out there, frontier life you never see in movies. <laughs> Jesus. The cleanest colons in the world. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> well, then again, maybe not. Mm. That one little old lady, he walked up and said, it's a beautiful day. Oh, yeah. She's like, she's like half yours. <laughs> Right to his face. <laughs> That's a little... <laughs> it's just little things like that. Yes. <laughs> you don't expect. <laughs> and I certainly did not expect it. <laughs> uh, no, this one's got me laughing here. This is a great all-around movie. Yeah. And considering how hot it is, Blazing Saddles was a proper movie to watch right now. Mm. This is like, folks, if you're not in Texas, it's like 110 every day here right now. I say he's joking about it being 114. It probably was 114. <laughs> yeah, for real. He probably wasn't joking out there. Yeah, it, yeah, it probably serious. It's 114. Like God, that poor, that poor little Chinese guy that painted. They're like, dock that man a half day's wage for sleeping on the job. Uh, guy probably had a heat stroke. <laughs> he probably died. Yeah, yeah, f uh, folks. Uh, let us know in the comments while we're at it as far as Mel Brooks movies go, whether it's this one or another one. What's your favorite? He's done some movies. Let us know what you like out there, guys. I want to hear them. I have seen a few of them. I know Dan's probably seen them all, so... I've seen all the comedies. This definitely ranks up there on the list for me. Mm. It's a close one between probably this and Spaceballs. Okay, fair enough. I, yeah, Spaceballs <laughs> is freaking out there, man. <laughs> uh, but yeah, let us know, guys. But go ahead and fill in the blanks for us, guys. There was a lot... There was a lot to unpack in this movie, but we want to save this one for you too, okay? But as always, if you're brand new to this channel, I hope you'll consider subscribing and help our channel grow. And if you enjoyed the video, leave a like and hit those bells to receive notifications every time we drop our next video. And should you feel compelled to give us a piece of your mind, do so in the comments, guys. While you're at it, take a look at us on our socials. We're on Instagram and TikTok. Come see what we're up to over there, guys. But until next time, this is Cocktail Flicks. I'm Joe. I'm Dan. We'll catch you on the flip side. Cheers to you, fam. Cheers to you, Dan. Cheers to you, Joe. Later, guys. Later, guys.